Woo! We are back doing our hair extensions. Wait, did I have it? Okay, video mode. Okay. Yeah, want to see comments? We're, we're live. It's fine. They can't hear it. Oh, telephone's ringing. Things are getting wild in here. Just wild. I've been, yeah, I'm doing a live video just to, to my installation. She can't. She's very busy right now. There she is. Alina. I'm back. <laughs> we're back. Putting them back in. Okay, so I'm going to just... I have to lean forward for a second when you okay, tell me. Right. To just, yeah, we're good. Okay. All right. We're back, people. We're back. We're putting them back in. Oh, lots of people joining in on this one. I'm getting the reinstallation so you can see what's happening with my hair. I took a picture before. It's on my wall so you can see what my hair looked like essentially without them in. But as she puts them in, so just separating them, I keep them low, okay, so that when your hair starts growing, you won't see the tapes. Even though they're the same color as my hair, you want to make sure that they're hidden. Because you want no one to know that you have hair extensions in, unless you put it live on the internet, and then everybody knows. <laughs> You're brave. I'm a brave girl, apparently, today, according to all the people. What's that? Oh yeah, I gotta keep my back. Oh yeah, there. I gotta, sorry, I gotta sit back here. That's all I have to do anything anyways. If you guys have questions, throw them down. We will answer them. You're getting like a free consultation right now, essentially. If you have any questions about any of this business that's going on. Yep. Does the installation hurt, Sarah? The installation does not hurt. I am a baby, so if you see me reacting, it's because I have a zero pain tolerance. So, but it doesn't hurt, no. Because all she's doing is she's sticking it to your hair, and well, you'll see more when it's on the side, but she sticks one and then sticks another one underneath, squeezes it together, and then she uses the straightener to kind of, um, it, you use it right on the sticky part, right? To melt it? No, she does not use it on the sticky part. Okay, so not on the sticky part. That's because we have the super tape, the original tape that comes on the extensions that usually salons use. You have to apply heat, that's a little bit more damaging, but we don't apply oh, any heat. Oh, okay, so there's, I don't know if you could hear her, I'll use my teacher voice. Um, so if you do um, extensions, like the original ones, like with the original tape, um, they do have to apply heat um, with a straightener to your hair, which can be more damaging, but they don't do that here. They will just have it, um, and they just stick them together, and then they just straighten. She's just straightening out my hair, so you'll see how long it is. It's curly. Without, yeah, it's curly, and so she always straightens it out for me. Sometimes curls it. <laughs> Depends on the day. And so she, like, presses it in, so when she's grabbing my head there, she's just pressing the, like, tape into the back of my head. So if you need a bit more, sometimes I'm a bit more sensitive than other times. Right now I'm okay, maybe because I'm talking and not, not thinking about what's going, thinking about what's going on. And guys, if you could share the broadcast with these girls, because I know a lot of you guys are in Ottawa, and I think they'd really appreciate it, because I would love to get them more business, because they're fabulous. And you have so much fun. I like coming here. I come every eight weeks. They see me too much. Oh no, live numbers just drop. What is going on? I hope that the connection's okay. That's weird though, that never happens. It's what? <laughs> oh. I'm too low, jeez. Oh no, she, uh, we're still live. No, it's still on. No, she's not. It's Alexandra. Okay, we're back. We, oh, here comes the numbers again. Things just dipped down there for a second. It was very scary. We thought something happened with the energy man. Oh no, we're back, we're back. Here they come. <laughs> Are we good now? Yeah, we're good now. I can't see any comments. Actually, can someone throw down a comment just to make sure they're working? I always like, sometimes mine don't work and then I get nervous that they're not working. And sometimes that happens. I don't know if anything's working right now. That's okay. Regardless, the replay will be fine. Oh, numbers are dropping again. Hello, hello. Oh, Gloria. Gloria, Alexandra, Brenda. I see lots of people on. Oh, there we go. Thank you, Darlene. See, I didn't even see Darlene's name pop up that she was on. So I think that the numbers are wrong on here. So Darlene, thank you for saying hello. So I know that the comments are working. So yeah, if you guys have questions about any of the installation, let me know. I can answer them straight up for you right now. Alina's got her extensions in. She's got hers. 
and they can color match. So, I mean, I remember just sending them a picture, but it's probably better if you come in though, so I can see the actual color of your hair, just to color match it exactly um, what your color is. They can do, you've done ombre. Yep. Yep, they can do ombre. Uh, what would be other, can you, you can do highlights or no? Yep, we match highlights. So they'll, it's two different tones. Okay, so they'll match your highlights. If you've got highlights, that's fine. Um, so they'll match with two different tones. I think we were almost going to do two different tones with mine last time too. We did, but you dyed them, right? Uh, no, we didn't because you only had straight in one of the colors. And I wanted to make sure that I was getting straight and curly. Or I didn't want straight and curly together because then it'd be like, then I'd have to straighten it every day. It still goes a little wavy, the straight, though. It doesn't straighten with the straight. Oh, it doesn't. Okay. So the weight. It's just not as wavy. Okay, so the straight extensions I showed in the last one, they are, um, they do get a bit of a wave, but not like the, these ones. Like these ones, um, if you gotta let your hair, like, if you let your hair dry, it kind of gets a natural curl. Like I, I rarely do anything with my hair because I spend more time on my makeup now. Um, so, oh. Oh, I was like, where are you going? Uh, how long does it take? So Charlene, um, it takes, if you're getting a, just an initial installation, like if you're brand new and you come and get it done, it takes about an hour, maybe a little bit more, depending on. And then if you're getting a reinstallation, so if you saw my last live, they have to take them out and then they have to retape them. You have to get your hair washed and then dried and then they put them back in. So I'll be here, I don't know what time it is. Two hours, two and a half hours, but I mean, we're kind of going, you don't have, do you have another client after me? Yes, she has another client after. So they usually will fit in about like two, two and a half, three hours to do a reinstallation and installation. You can take the extensions out yourself uh, with oil and then wash your hair with basically dish soap because you want it really, really um, clarifying. If you don't have clarifying shampoo, I've done it with dish soap before. And I've taken them half out before, I think. Um, but I prefer just to have them do it because they use alcohol now, which is a little bit less damaging. And it's like sometimes it's really hard to get the oil out. Mm -hmm. So, oh yeah, no, it's not that bad, Charlene. And I come every eight weeks, but most people will push it three months to, I don't know, five, five months. It's not recommended. Not recommended because they grow down, right? Your hair grows. So tape is not micro beading. No, but they do do micro beading here, right? Yes. So you can see, so I'm wearing a black shirt. So kind of, so this is my hair extensions being put in. Oh, Tasha is back on. Now that I call her back, my, it's the right name. <laughs> I like calling her Leanne though. It's her new name. It's her new name. Oh, there's Jenna. Hi, Jenna. Jenna, I took home your leftovers last night from dinner. <laughs> she left them on the table. I don't know what taco you had, but apparently it was very spicy. My boyfriend ate it. And yeah, so Charlene, hey, if you want to make a trip to Ottawa, don't be shy. She's only in, where are you, Charlene? You're, she's near Kingston. I didn't even know oh you had God. extensions. Oh my God, you didn't know I had extensions? Well, secret's out. <laughs> yeah, there's a lot of girls. I have a, probably like five or six hundred just in Kingston alone. My team. Oh, do you? Oh, you have lots of clients that come. Yeah, you have clients from all over. You have clients from Toronto, Montreal that come. To you guys, Barockville, Castleman. Castleman, totally didn't know either. Well, surprises out, guys. I don't actually have big luscious hair, <laughs> but this is yeah, this is fun though. <laughs> Sterling, so Sterling's near, kind of near Kingston. How far are you from Ottawa, Sherlene? That'd be like what, two hours? Maybe three. Nope, I totally did it. Well. Like, that's the thing. There you go. There's two girls who've known me for, well, Charlene's known me for a year and a half since I've had them for sure. Wow. And uh, outside Belleville. Okay. And uh, Jenna, how long, Jenna, have I known you? I say probably like at least a year. So, I mean, and I've only had them, I got them in December 2015. And then had them all last year. This is my third set of extension hair. So you can reuse this hair over and over, which is really nice. Yeah. Oh, three and a half hours. Yeah, it'll save you some money if you're using your hair. Just a new set. What are the pricing? It starts at 
taxes included. Okay, so 483 taxes included for a new set of hair. And then reinstallation. It's 220 every three months. 220 every three months. So, I mean, Everybody's if I'm honest, it. guys, like, I used to do my hair a lot. Like, I'd spend a lot of money on, like, dyeing it and doing different things for a change. But now that I have these, I don't get haircuts because I have these in. Um, and my hair has grown like crazy. And I also, all I do is dye it one color now. So when I go to the hair salon, it's not that expensive. And I honestly, and now that I'm getting a little bit more gray, I have to go a little bit more often. But I think my first time back to the actual hair salon to get hair done. Oh shoot, where was the battery here? Sorry. Um, to get hair salon was, um, I went, it took me about a year to go back to the hair salon. This is kind of like my hair salon now. So I don't really get a lot. Imagine. What's that? Oh, and then you're just putting in some real hair. It's a different color. Awesome. My phone, it might die, but no, I have the plug-in thing. You can just turn it to the side. I'm all equipped. I have my phone. Well, is your phone like that, though? My phone's always nine. Yeah, so like, we both have iPhone 6. We're both waiting for the 8. We don't know if it's coming out or not. We've been looking at some articles. We do a lot of research when we're here, but either celebrities or apparently about phones. Oh, if you share the broadcast, let us know so that we can shout you out and say thank you for sharing the broadcast because these girls would super appreciate it. Even if you're not in the Ottawa area, like we have, they have lots of clients in Kingston, Montreal, Toronto, uh, Brockville, Castleman. Pretty much everywhere in Ottawa. Everywhere in Ottawa and then the surrounding areas as well as as far as Toronto. Um, just because their prices are like, honestly, if you look up prices for hair extensions, you will not find the same prices at all. Most of them are about a thousand dollars. And the quality is horrible. The quality is horrible. Yeah, so the quality of the hair that's the biggest thing is like, you don't want um, synthetic hair, first of all. Like, yes, there is somebody else's hair in my head, so it might be like, where this is Russian hair, yeah, yeah, so the Russian hair. Russians. They're Russian, so it's not from their family though. <laughs> so once it gets to 10%, I'll plug it in. These are the sensitive parts where I'm like, eh, it kind of hurts, but it doesn't really at all. <laughs> They're just taping to your head. Like the micro beating is a bit more intensive. Like, do you pull hair through? It's, it's piece by piece, so it's about this thick each piece. So okay. So to wrap it with like a needle, so this is the core hair, and then you put the ring and then you put the extensions. It to, to takes it longer as well. Like this insulation is not usually that bad. I remember it being. Well, we're almost done the bag. Yeah. Yeah, it's oh. pretty nice. No, it's like. I'm new. LOL. That's okay, Charlene. Gotta go at all. Okay, I'll see you soon. Hello, Sarah. I'll just keep saying hi to people as they jump on. May as well. Sarah's in the Ottawa area. A lot of people from Ottawa in here. So if you're from Ottawa, I can tell you there's probably a lot of people that have wondered what I thought about hair extensions for. A long time and then I met um, a girl named Tasha who I was like my god you have the nicest hair ever and then she told me and then I had added her to Facebook and I saw the glam fairies on her wall so I thought she did it I was like oh I'm like do you do hair extensions and then she's like no 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 like I go get them done so I was like okay and then I was asking her questions about it I actually probably asked her more questions than I asked these girls <laughs> and so they she gave me all the info about it and then uh, and then I met Leah who's Alina's sister who's right there but she's not a camera and uh, so I had asked her questions about it and then I went to her house when they were just running their salon out of their houses and I got it done and it was scary I was honestly it's like one of those things right anytime you get something done for the first time you're like super terrified but then I loved it and now I'm addicted but I know that every time I get something done then I'm like love to do I'm that person that will just keep going back and it makes it easier like I like I said I spend more time I feel like girls either spend more time on their hair or more time on their makeup. This saves me so much time because I don't have to like, I used to always curl my hair or like, uh, ways to make it look thicker, exactly. So this is sort of my, now I can make my hair look thicker just by getting out of the shower. <laughs> so, but I do like, like to straighten it and curl it if I'm going out and it's fun to be able to have long hair again. So I'm going to just... Yeah, I'm gonna just plug it in and then I'll turn it to the side.
I gotta move this over. Sorry. We're doing a little mix up here. We're back. <laughs> just comments on the speech on the side. Oh, usually it flips them, I think. Yeah. Usually it'll flip the comments. I guess you have to do it from the beginning. I can read on the side. She goes more. Oh, oh, Lee is very on. I can see your sister. Oh, she's on. Naya? Your shoulder. Oh. Your shoulder's on. <laughs> she's working hard on the girl beside me. No, oh, oh, no, 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 she's not alive. She did join the last one, though. Yeah. Just getting my hands. Yeah, so she can't, it's hard to see, you can't see the back, but she likes to swing it around. Let her straighten this, and I'll show you the. All of a sudden, I have thick hair. And it blends. And it blends. That's huge. Like, honestly, these girls have posted pictures of other hair salons and girls that have come in to either get them fixed or they've either, like, showed them the pictures. But usually it's girls that came to get them fixed, right? That, that show up with their hair extensions and where they got them in different places. And it's absolutely a disaster. And you do not, if you're wondering, like, you don't need to, like, strain it perfectly like this in order for it to blend properly. Like, if you've ever seen my lives or you're on my Facebook, 90% of the time I don't have anything done to my hair. It's just there. I do it because it's easier for me to work. Yes, and it's easier for her to work and it's easier to see and... Like, look how beautiful this hair is. And it's exactly matching. Like, look at there's three girls, two girls on here that have known me for over a year that had no idea my hair was hair extensions. And it's long. It's long and it just blends and it's nice. And I'm going to dye it next week so it's all going to be really dark and shiny and beautiful. Woohoo! And that's why it's nice to have long hair and it's manageable. No, it's long. Done the back, so then you can see for now. And then, oh, are you going to the sides now? Yeah. Going to the sides. Oh, hello, well, okay, and Alicia. Alicia's in Kingston. Hey, Alicia, if you wanted her extensions, Kingston's not that far. Okay, you're in the East End. They're just in Gatineau. I'm just going to call it where everybody is. Marianne, you're in Ottawa. Marianne was at dinner last night. Marianne, did you know that I have hair extensions in? Well, that's a nice thing, right? Like, and if people meet you for the first time, then they don't know. They're not gonna know. My best friends know, knew right away. They're like, wait, your hair's really long. <laughs> but that's okay. I'm not scared to admit it. Like, why am I gonna be scared to admit it? I love it. What's going on over there? Or causing a ruckus. Where? Me? No. Oh, that's scared to hurt her. What's going on over there? It's always a fun time with our ruckus. Never had before, but like trying new things. The camera is sideways. I know it's sideways because I have to plug my phone in. Is it? But you can see okay, hopefully. <laughs> I have to keep it sideways because of my phone was dying, as it usually is. And so I had to keep the charge going or the live would finish. <laughs> All good. I had it. It's actually better. And here's a tip for you, okay? If you ever push your business, um, you should do all your videos to the side like this because when you put them on YouTube, you don't have the black things on the side. Some guy called me out on it and he's like, Your videos would look way better if you did it on the side. But the only thing is, you have to remember to look at the camera, whereas we all are so used to looking at the screen when we're doing videos. So you are supposed to actually, if you are. You know, running a business where you are doing lives, that's a good tip for you to do it on the side. Because when you upload them, they look more professional. So when Alina starts doing all of her live videos, then she's going to be here every day. Yeah, I'll just have to be here filming every day for her. It's going to be my new job. Just hanging out. They're a great company. Yeah, so. Yeah, that's good. Yeah. So I like to get them one day maybe. That's awesome. Hey girl, how's it going? Hope you are well. All is well. Just getting my hair reinstalled. So I usually do it like 
like pretty well. You can see where she's putting it in. That's sort of like the same level all around my head because if you put them too high, or if you get these done elsewhere and they put them too high, you're gonna be able to see the tape as they grow out. So. So look how long, yeah, my hair is like crazy long. Especially when it's straightened, people really notice like how long it's getting when it's straightened. Yeah. You guys are the best straightener. I feel like I need to get the same straightener. Like I don't ever get like, well, I mean, you do it, I think you can see better in the back obviously, but I never have the same shine. Which straightener do you guys use? Oh, carrot. Oh, okay. Oh. It's because it vibrates. It vibrates? Yeah, I see. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I do. Apparently the hair straightener vibrates, people. Things are about to get wild. It's actually true. It does. Those but why does it more. vibrate? Because when I do character treatment. Sensitive part. Sides are more sensitive. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry, guys. Zero pain tolerance. It's okay. So. It doesn't actually hurt her. It just, just shoves She's it in there. Baby. I'm a big baby, it's she likes to tell me. Well, actually, I'm okay. sensitive too, so I can't say anything. Oh, yeah, you then, oh, now it comes out, now that she's live. Usually she's <laughs> yelling at me, like, stop it, it doesn't hurt. <laughs> she's not actually yelling. Can you feel that? Okay, no, oh. Why does it vibrate? Can you feel it? A little bit. Well, What's on your hair, right? <laughs> I'm like, it's on my hair, no, but I can, but why does it vibrate, though? What's the point of that? Okay, so this is the hair straightener that I. Oh my god, it's vibrating. <laughs> so there's like two options. You can have it. Can you order one of these online, or does it have to be from a salon store? We got it from a professional hair salon store. Okay, professional hair salon store. Um, I'm not sure. Maybe you can find them somewhere else. Maybe Amazon. Okay, I'll get the name brand of that from They're kind of pricey, but it's not Oh my god, like it's so worth it though, because I know when I straighten my hair, it does not look like this. I have a chi. I don't like those. Okay, so you don't like the cheese? No, I don't. I actually really don't. My mom has it, and every time she wants me to style her hair at home, I always complain because it just doesn't do the job. Okay, so cheese are not good, guys. I always thought cheese was like the top end. Well, the used to be when it came out. Yeah, because I remember like, yeah. Now that you, there's other better stuff. Okay, so the cheese are not good hair straighteners, guys. So if you have hair straightener chi, you need to get this one, whatever it is. <laughs> throw it out, throw out your chi hair straighteners, people. They are not good. <laughs> <laughs> but I want this one. If you can see how sh like the lighting in here is doing it no justice, but my hair is like so shiny. We lost we lost the comb. Oh look at it. maybe the light. Oh, I'm blocking it. Oh there, see. If you can see, like it's like the softest, most shiniest, friggin' best. Oh, thanks for the thumbs up and the hearts. You guys are sweet. Shout these girls out. Hello, Najla. Actually, Najla, these girls brought up uh, how you put mascara on your husband. They're like, she loved it. They watched your video on um, how you put mascara on your husband if you're still on. Hello, Taryn. I will see you next week, Taryn. Taryn is doing my makeup for a wedding next week. She is fabulous. If you need your makeup done, I will give her a shout out right now. And I think Taryn, you're friends with these girls on Facebook, I'm pretty sure. Taryn has thick, awesome hair, but it's she's got short hair. So Taryn, if you ever want to do a long hair, you can come here and get her extensions. <laughs> You can see the tapes, that's what they look like. So they're pretty much the color of my hair. They look shiny because of the light right now, but they're not actually shiny. Let's see there. I'll keep my head to the side so you can see the... So see how it's kind of like wavy so she'll straighten it out? But. So she takes the tape. Oh wait, are we putting this one? Yeah, these ones are going under. So this is how they get installed. So they're really not... Um, high tech, I guess. I don't know what the word I'm looking for is. But then she pushes it down. And the super tape, this tape doesn't move, guys. I wash my hair normally. I straighten it normally. 
Um, the one thing that you like, obviously you can't brush from your roots because it's going to get caught in there, but I do brush this top part of my hair from the roots, no problem. Um, and then you kind of just skip over and you can brush the ends of it, no problem. The one thing you shouldn't do is brush when your hair is wet. Because, because it can pull them out. I did a lot of research before I got these. And I, and when I first got them, uh, Leah made me write down all the rules in my phone. So don't brush them when they're super wet. So that's why this is, it's not good for your real hair to brush your hair when it's wet. So there's another tidbit if you don't have extensions, which most of you probably don't. Don't brush your hair when it's wet. It causes a lot of breakage. But... That's why most of the time I don't end up doing anything to my hair because when I let it dry naturally now, it looks fine. Whereas before it was like a disaster. So I always had to do something um, with it. So I honestly love that I don't have to do anything with it. Yes, she yelled at me quite a lot last time uh, about how I never do anything with straight hair and I never put any effort in. <laughs> Because I'm always live doing makeup and she's seeing my hair and she's like, what is she doing? No, your hair looks good. I just never see you with straightener. No, I never do this. Because my my straightener, I need to buy the straightener. I want this. Look at this. Look, look at the straightening job this does. My hair never looks like this when I straighten it. Like, I mean, I know she's doing it for me, but it doesn't matter. Like, the straightener should be, would be the reason that it looks this good, right? Oh, hi, mom. Oh, <laughs> Oh, mom, I put uh, a mascara in the mailbox, FYI. I was at the house today. So just ignore my message that I sent you for Amy. Amy, if you are also watching, you can pick up your mascara in my mailbox at my parents' house, which I haven't given you the address, so I will text that to you. <laughs> but yeah, no, I haven't given the address. I have to text it to you. It's the same as last time, though, if you have it still, but you might not, so I will send it. Is at home. Hi, okay, great. I also left a mascara there, Mom, in case a Canada customer needs one. Then you can just throw it in the mailbox. That one's not for anyone specific. That's the backup for any girls that want the new Epic Mascara. That is sold out till mid September right now. This girl can hook you up because I've got some on hand. Okay. Hi, Leah. Hi. This is their sister. They work together every so day. Different. You're so different. Oh, What's that? One blonde stuff. Oh, I know. You could never guess. No, I wouldn't have guessed you guys. Got it. Thanks, Mom. Now, my mom's on. I had to tell her because I had to drop by the house before I came here to put a mascara in the mailbox. So, I didn't want her wondering why there was someone coming to the house. Oh, it's so pretty. It is very pretty. I love getting this done. If only I had somewhere fun to go. <laughs> Good, hair Good hair never what? Sleeps on, a Sleeps on a Friday. That's true. Too bad it's Wednesday. <laughs> I have to go to the gym later. I'm going to ruin my hair. What? I know. She's so mad. I have to just go with my braid. Oh, yeah. yeah. I like doing my braid. Ladies, if you've ever wanted long, beautiful hair, instantly. Like, are we keeping them long or are we doing... We're just keeping them loose. Oh, look how pretty that looks. See, yeah, I can't do this either. <laughs> okay, this. Twist it in. Twist it in, okay. It's great, now I have it on video. Oh, look at it. See, guys, if you ever wondered how do celebrities do this, that's how you do it. You should get celebrity stylist. You fit right in. You already looked Hollywood. Oh, please. <laughs> Elena's all Hollywood. She has all the Hollywood things. Oh my god, no, no. <laughs> How sure it's your hair? Just not the money, right? Just not the money. It's okay. One day. One day. Okay, I have to bring this back. That's fine. I'm just keeping it on. So long, you have to like, sit up. Keep it on. Last side. I'm almost done, guys. We were live pretty much the whole time, yeah. So that way, if girls are watching the replay, you can just kind of fast forward to the end if you want to see the end result. 
figured that's probably easiest. You don't need to sit here and watch our antics. <laughs> oh, big message there. What's that saying? Hi guys. I can't read it. Is that on the live? Yeah. Go oh, here, I'll grab it. Let me see here. Hi guys, I only wish to take in look it's like yours. When I got them in the tape was showing so bad I couldn't even wear it up. And as I said, every strand had a tape in while hair fell out. Oh my god. And taking them out. I still have the hair and would love to get them back in, but I'm so scared. You're doing amazing. <laughs> okay, well Sh are, Shannon, are you in Ottawa? I don't um, are you in Ottawa? Because these girls, I mean, like I said, so if you watch my other live, so when I um, get them out and then they comb my hair out because there's still some glue and they use some oil to get it out and then they wash your hair, a lot of hair will come out because the way that they're taped, you're seeing how she's putting them in, um, like it's holding, like it's sandwiching hair, right? So that sandwiched hair stays in for... Uh, eight like that's eight weeks of hair that hasn't shed so it looked like I, I I mean I have like a clump like this of hair that comes out after um, they take them out but it's because that's all hair that hasn't shed and then my hair is pretty much back to normal I haven't lost any hair I know that for sure my hair was always thinnish um, but it's grown like crazy and I definitely don't have like bald spots and everything. Oh, you're in Nova Scotia. Well, hey, just one quick porter flight. <laughs> <laughs> right? But if you're ever in Ottawa, if you're ever in the Ottawa area, they're in Gatineau, which is in Quebec. Um, but it's pretty much, it's like five minutes from downtown Ottawa. Um, people get scared when they hear People get scared far. when they hear Gatineau. Okay, so it's not, <laughs> they think it's what? Oh yeah, they do think it's far. It is literally five minutes from downtown Ottawa. Um, so if you are ever in the area, like they would be happy. Now do you have like the tape, the tape's a big thing though. Like how big was the tape? Like if you see these ones, they're tiny, they're tiny but I don't know how big the tapes were that you got. Like mine will only show if I like wait way too long to get them reinstalled, which I don't because I'm a baby and I don't like them showing at all. But I could wear my hair up. I go to the gym, I play soccer. Um, you just kind of have to like, if you have to hide them, you just kind of comb over them a little bit, but it's uh, now that they're at the top of my head, it'll be fine. Tiny, like how small? These ones, that's weird. Like, I'll show you, uh, the next one she grabs, I'll show you the size of these ones, Shannon, um, so that you can see. Like, I don't know how tiny yours were, but these ones are... Ours are smaller from here. They, they're this thin, like they're here. You can see the blue. Blue. The blue, the blue, okay. the blue. So the blue is where the tape well, no, is. So this, the blue is bigger. Depends how I install it, right? So this would be the. Oh, okay. So uh, you can see that the size of the tape. You can see where it is. It's small, like, and it's the color of my hair, so you don't see it. The blue is not the side that goes down. <laughs> so yeah. The blue is here. Yeah. Yeah. The blue's gone. <laughs> so people sometimes think the tape is blue, and no. No, the tape is not the blue. Yes, it's the same. Okay, so maybe it was just the installation. And the big thing too is depends on where they installed it. If they did it too high up, like I get mine, uh, they're here. And then all the way around my head. Like I don't like them high up because then like I can't do like a top knot, I can't do. You have to put them towards the back. And you have to put them towards the back. If they're too close to your face, um, they'll show for sure. So like really, I think it might've been just maybe the way they installed them. Does she have short hair though? Do you have short hair, Shannon? Because if it's shorter, you have to build length, so you have to go closer to the face. Because if I go backwards, your hair is oh, short, it'll okay. be short. Okay, so if you have shorter hair, they have to kind of build closer to your face, right? Because otherwise it'd be like short and then long. So you have to kind of build it. My hair is really long now. Like this is my, this is the front of my real hair. And then I'm just trying to find, see, I can't even, I don't even want to separate it, but it's, uh, mine's about to here. So that's my real hair now, but that's because it's been a year and a half of wearing these and it's grown like crazy and I don't cut it because you can't really do a haircut on this because it's all mixed together. Oh, thanks Alicia. That's so nice of you. I need this straightener. That's it. That's it. You're going to find one for me. <laughs> Put you on. We can take the name off. Yeah, something with a Z. Zoran. Zoran. Anyone knows how to get a Zoran hair straightener? 
throw down a link or something. Oh, well, she can get us one. Okay, she's gonna hook it up. Yeah, I need these in my life. Like mine straighter is fine, but it's not. It doesn't do the same shine. I can curl really well with it, but I'm sure that one will curl even better. And then there's a vibrator on it apparently, so that's a big vibrating <laughs> option so that you can. On it. It's not a vibrator. Uh, it's a vibrating option. <laughs> For keratin treatments. Keratin? Is that right? What's a keratin what is treatment? Is that like where like they take like uh, really curly hair and make it straight? Well, it doesn't make it shoot completely. It takes out frizz. Yeah, it does remove all the frizz and there's organ oil in it. So it is a treatment that's going to make your hair softer, oh. more shinier, healthier. It will grow faster. Oh, okay. It's like a repair, but at the same time it removes the frizz. So it Do you guys get it on your hair? I usually do it all the time before I go south, so before I go on the beach in New Orleans. Okay, yeah, so a few girls on my team were telling me when we went to New Orleans last week, they got, the, I think that's what they got done. The keratin treatment? Yeah. It's actually really popular, but a lot of people don't know about it, and they're scared, they think it's all chemicals, but it's not, so. And you can do the keratin treatment on the extensions? You can, but it's pointless, right? Because you're going to change them eventually. Oh. And it's not cheap, it's still $300. Oh, okay. So you don't want to do it on your extensions, probably. You want to do it on your real hair. Okay. But. So you take out your extensions and then do the keratin treatment and put them in? You can't do extensions and the treatment on the same day. Oh. Because when you do the treatment, you have to wait eight hours before you rinse it. Oh, okay. So the next day, you do it. Woo -woo. Almost done, ladies. Almost done. If you're just joining, you're seeing the final product. So when I post the uh, video, you'll be able to see the process. Okay, we have one more piece. And she just usually throws it somewhere in the back. So that it. So yeah, so they go like they're here. Yeah, so like I can like put this in a top knot, I can wear my hair half up, I can, and then when I put it back too, I use this hair on top, if they're showing it all, if it's growing out a little bit, I use the hair on top to cover it. I can do a top bun, I do everything basically. It's just like normal hair, you just, you'll figure out how to like wear it so that they're not showing, but it's really rare that they show. Oh, there's a few more there. How many? Two. Two. Two more. It's good. You look amazing. Great job. Thanks, Shannon. <laughs> well, look, she's going to look you guys up if she ever comes from Nova Scotia to Ottawa. That would be fun. Yeah, do it up. There's lots of girls that have come here from all over Canada. We have clients from Egypt. We have clients from where again? Egypt? Yeah. Florida. Florida. New York. New York. Florida, New York. Wow, these guys are multinational. Usually people like come visit here and they get extensions. Oh, Paris! I had Paris like yeah. a month ago. Oh, you have Paris? Yeah, Paris a month ago. How did she hear about you guys? Well, Online. she uh, yes. Yeah, so Online. Searched and she was here just to visit. Yeah. And she was going back. And she did researches in Paris and it was around three thousand dollars. Oh. Three thousand dollars in Paris, guys. Don't get hair extensions there. <laughs> so she decided to do them here before she goes back. And she was like so in love. Have you heard well, from her? Now she has to find someone a little cheaper there because she's addicted now. Oh shoot! Well, the only reason it's cooler to live in Ottawa than Paris is if you can get way cheaper hair extensions, guys. Mm -hmm. And it's from euro, right? so. and euro, so three thousand dollars. That's what they charge to do this. And I know a lot of places in the states. You guys have a lot of Americans, don't you? I remember you telling me about some people that were in the states that couldn't find anybody. Yeah. Moving well, there. We always still want asking us to buy hair, but we never usually sell it. We want it to be exclusive. Yeah, so they don't sell their hair to other salons, so you have to come to them. Which I like honestly guys, the hair is like it doesn't it doesn't look any different than my hair. It's like it's real hair, so it's not synthetic. It's exactly the same as what's on my head. Nobody knew I had extensions till today apparently. <laughs> It's a good thing. Yeah, you don't want people to know you have hair extensions. Cause let me tell you, uh, being at a convention with 10,000 women last week. Oh, someone just gave an angry face. Being at a convention last week with 10,000 women. Uh, I will tell you, I saw a lot of bad hair extensions. It was bad. Oh, so you. Oh, okay. We're almost done. 
One more. One more, then we're done. And you can see the final product. I knew. Yes, mom, you knew because I came to dinner a week later with like six inches more on my hair. You used to get them shorter, remember? And you'd get yeah, them I got really, okay, so when I first got them, I was really paranoid that everyone was gonna know I had extensions, so I got them. You can, they can cut them, and they can get them shorter. I mean, even if you look at Leah's hair, she you have extensions in her, right? Not anymore. No? That's all yours? All hers. Wow, okay, I lied, but I know she has had extensions with short hair before. Short. But you can get it like shorter if that's what you prefer, because it's for volume, right? You can get a bob, you can get long, right? So it was hard for me to be like, okay, everyone's gonna know because I'm gonna have like six inches more on my hair. But I actually was able to cover it pretty well because they cut it like short-ish. And then once I had them for, what, six months, then it just felt more normal to have them in. Um, and people didn't, people are just used to them now. Like it's weird if I had them out. If I took them out, everyone would think I got a haircut. That's not the case. Be ready oh. in two minutes. Okay. Oh, yeah. Nice clients here. Very busy. It's a very busy salon. You got to book them two weeks in advance, at least. Two weeks or three? Three weeks. Two weeks. <laughs> two weeks in advance. If you want to get in. Yeah, depending on the week, I guess. And if you can come during the week, I mean, I'm lucky right now because I'm off for the summer. So I can come during the day, during the week. So we are done. Woo! Here, I'll go, I'll face the window so you can just see. Just thanks. Oh. So there's the... Hair flip I like. The hair flip, see the hair flip? Wait, wait, wait. She's all over the hair, oh, and she's gonna spray it. She always does with spray. Wait, I don't like it. No, oh, she doesn't like the hair flip. She's redoing the hair flip, people. I can't go to the gym now. Look at my, how nice my hair is. I'm going to go shopping instead. There we go. Okay, guys. Hair flip. Flipping me around. I love the smell of this. Do you? Did you smell it? It smells like hairspray. <laughs> oh, it's Moroccan oil. I've never used Moroccan oil. Oh, I love the smell. Let me just throw my Lumi on. Okay, here, I'll flip around this way so you can see the final product. I'm trying not to get you on the uh, block you with my head. It's not cut yet. Not cut yet, but are you doing a photo? Okay. Yeah. Yeah, we can, I'll just trim them a little bit. Okay, we're gonna do a photo after and then I'll post it so you can see. I'm live right now, that's why I was like being a weirdo right now. Okay, all right, so we're gonna finish this one up. Thank you for watching and stay tuned for the photo. And you know exactly where to get your hair extensions now, ladies.